All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is XCOM Enemy Within Part 30. So, it's a brand new month. We've got a lot of credits to play with, but I don't know if we have anything we really want to spend the credits on, you know? Oh, that Spectre. Losing Spectre on that Covert Ops mission. Brutal future is right. We've lost six people. Seven. Seven, even. Damn. Um. I don't remember all of them, to be honest, but... Your sacrifices, that's why you're in that thing, so that we can't forget entirely. Pending quests. Cannot complete floater Rex. Nah, we don't need that. Uh, Great market? We don't need credits. We're really set on credits. We want to be able to buy some stuff, not sell stuff. We'll upgrade the mech we don't have the, the meld for. This would cost 100 meld to upgrade. We need to get a bunch of meld together. Yeah, we just need to get a bunch of meld together. I don't think we need things. I was looking at some upgrades, but everything I might want costs weapon fragments. And that's just not important right now. Sentinel drone, no. Stealth satellites, I don't even know what this does for us, but we might just do it just because we have money to burn, and I'm not sure. Sure. ETA four days, sure. Like I said, I don't, I don't know what that does for us, to be honest. Jelly delirium, 25 delirium. Tactical situations is quite risky. In the absence of full-size crafts, regulated fuel management systems, adding it to our flamethrowers would be a da da too dangerous. With some additional investment, though, we could devise a formula to increase flamethrower effectiveness without risking our soldiers. Sure. Why not? We've got the money to burn. The foundry is already warmed up. I'll make sure to notify you as soon as production is finished. Okay. We need this fusion lance for our ship, I think. Alright, let's go on this covert extraction. Covert operative is ready for extraction. The operative holds intel about the location of the exile base, so safe contact back to base is essential. We are confident that you will handle this matter with discretion. I'm confident we got this, too. Oh, w wait, whoa, 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 we did get those three people. They actually did join us. Whoa. Wait a second. Yeah, put Crater in there, first off. Back to briefing. Hold up. Check the barracks. Electo, Magera, and Tissaphone. Okay, Matthew Hawkins, Lieutenant Sniper. They start at Lieutenant, that's not too bad. Oh, this guy could be our new agent. Electo. Perfect. Go squad site, then go a gunslinger. Disabling shot. Yeah, we can get this guy in here. He could be our new pistol guy. And then Magera is a lieutenant. To support um, Sprinter is just so good. Field Medic is really good. Revive Suppression. Instead of just stabilizing them. Yeah, that's huge. Whoops. And then Tissaphone. Who's a Lieutenant Assault? Running Gun. Tactical Sense. It's too valuable to not have. Lightning reflexes, of course. Flush or rapid fire? Gotta be rapid fire. It's it, The thing with Assault in XCOM 1 is it's so easy to know what to take. This one you could almost argue on, but like these two, it's really hard to argue against. Especially rapid fire versus flush. Alright. Well, now let's go. Send extraction squad. Launch mission, and we look forward to I think we're ready to go. Progress. After we give Odin his Titan armor, because he didn't have it last time. There we are. There we go. Crater, ready to go. Do we have any more, uh... We don't. Okay. He'll take that one, then. Axel's ready. Snake Eyes is ready. Songbird needs a mech. Give this man a mech. 
There we go. Give him a railgun. Going in heavy with two mechs. That'll be great. Particle cannon, okay. Look at their stats. 110 will, 84 aim, 24 HP. 26 HP, 107 will, 82 aim. <laughs> Insane. Alright. Um, snake eyes. I think you're missing a loadout. Yeah. I'll take that just in case it matters. Ah, oh, never mind. She's never going to get close enough to be able to use an arc thrower. Who am I kidding? Take a grenade in case it matters. I doubt it, though. Alright, let's go. Do this. Exalt has another cell operating inside the Argentinian border. Strike one will have to secure the area and ensure our operative can retrieve the intel we need. So is it the double satellite one? Hey, at least this is a new map. We've been getting the same map over and over with this, I'm pretty sure. Deployed was interrupted by Exalt forces while attempting to gather intel from an Exalt communications relay. Gotcha. If our operative is going to finish the job, Strike One will have to protect them while they hack the remaining arrays. The operative must survive if we have any hope of retrieving that data. New objective received. Understood. Well then, let's see what we're working with. I'm moving to that position. Hostile Go for it, Chang. Spotted. There's some Exalt right there. Oh, Wells. Wells does not have super legs, I don't think. No, she doesn't. Which means we're going to have to put her in a real spot. A light plasma rifle. Let's look at our other options. Lambert? Man, Lambert, you cannot run very far. <laughs> you are not a fast man. It's okay. Just not a fast man. I mean, I guess we take this shot because there's no better to take. Nice. That seven damage doesn't hurt. Oh, yeah, we could pop this guy. Seventy-five percent because he's that far away in full cover. I mean, it's possible she could miss, but it's Snake Eyes, right? Out of the game. Bang! Ah, <laughs> oh, she didn't get her double tap. Oh well. Alright, you do have super legs, Odin. I know that. Let's go here and see if anything's up top. Okay, nothing up top. Songbird. We got a couple shots lined up, looks like. Uh, we can take this 64. Oh my god, are we gonna hit that too? Ooh, we're off to a good start on hits. Very nice. So it's shield left, Axel, and Jang has a shot. He can shoot once at least. Let's see if Jang lands his shot. 42% though. Not ideal. Let's go Overwatch instead. Yeah, that's probably better. Um, I mean, yo, Shield's not in a good spot. I kind of don't even want to move him right now until we're closer to him. Guess we'll have to move Axel in the half cover or something? Nah, let's not. Let's there could be anything in this building too, and I don't wanna I don't wanna open that up either. Hmm. This is a tough call for what to do with her. What is that? Aye, aye, Commander. I guess I'll just move her here. 60%, really? That is surprising. 
can also do suppression. Yeah, let's do suppression. Hi, Commander. Suppression. Keep him locked down. Um, honestly, shield, I don't think I want to move you yet. Let's stay hunkered down for a second. The aliens are falling back. All right, here's some guys. Yo, he stayed locked down. He didn't do a thing. <laughs> Damn. He's like, what? What? Okay. Shield, what do we got? Okay. Okay. Let's get him out of here. Okay. That went really well. Let's get Jong forward. He can flank from there. And look inside. Okay, looks like we're kind of clear. Honestly. Go ahead, John. Bang. This one is finished. Alright, crater. Let's go ahead and uh, overwatch. Right there. See, Snake Eyes can take that shot, but then she's standing in the open still. And I don't like that she keeps staying in the open. Let's just get her... Um, damn. Yeah, I don't like where she's standing, to be honest. If we put Songbird here, what are we looking at? We can kill him with Songbird. Bang. Very good. And then she can squad sight fire on this guy. Get him, Snake Eyes. Boom! <laughs> and then double tap. We destroyed cover, which lets us kill the other guy. Dang, Snake Eyes. That's crazy. That's awesome. Snake Eyes is a monster. We already do that, though. Alright, Odin. Take the rest of them out. That guy's like, what just happened? Where did that come from? Already there. Move Axel up there. What is she looking at? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Alright, shield. Two up top. Get these comm relays hacked. We can almost get these in back to back turns. Relays, Commander. We just have to activate it and that data will be ours. We've successfully hacked the relay, Commander, while also disrupting Exalt's communication system. We'll need to keep looking for any nearby relays to get the remaining data. Excellent. And then we can get this one next turn. Because he's got that movement speed from being a support. I do like that a lot. That part. Boy. Boy. Alright, Songbird. Let me know if you see anything. Nothing. Let's go ahead and reload. Now's our chance. Honestly, I'll even move Axel back. I don't know what she's looking at. She's bugged out. Jang's movement speed is so insane. I love it. Crater can hold down the fort back here. Snake Eyes can hold off right here. Let's go here. There we go. Look at that hop. The height on that. <laughs> Alright, there's some new Exalt. Overwatch. That's fine. Ah, we got Odin. And we... Oh, dang. Okay, Odin. Almost got him. Yeah, we have Odin and Snake Eyes up here. They're doomed. Ah, 
miss from downstairs. Okay. Enemy is still alive. That's fine. We got it. No worries. We have snake eyes. Covering fire. Interesting. Damn, that's that an ability I wasn't expecting. Covering fire also works against the people shooting at you. That's really interesting. Snake guys take out a few more people. Bang. Bye bye. Just that easy. Let's go ahead and move Odin back. Watch. Overwatch. Alright, shield. Go hack the other one, and then we're out of here, I think. That's all the data we're going to get, Commander. Now we just need to get our operative to the evac point for extraction. We have a new objective. Escort the operative to the evac zone. Can do. Ten four. Axel here. Crater can go back here. Alright, John. Let's see your movement speed in action. Look at this movement speed. <laughs> oh my god. That's so much space. Makes sense, though. Look how fast he runs. Damn. Got new contacts moving in, Commander. Yep, here they are. Trying to cut off our evac. Rude. A lot of them, actually. A lot, a lot of them. Four different ones there. Alright. Well, let's see. We don't have any uh, assaults to be able to break the uh, overwatches with, do we? Okay. Well, let's do this then. Axel. Nice. Got the 60% crit I was looking for. Of course it's a hundred on everybody. Wish I still had headshot, but that's all right. Boom! Let's go. Yes. Is he gonna get Overwatch shot? He's not. This guy's doomed. Get the sixty-four. Wow, this mission went beautifully. We hit every shot we really could. Just everything went right. On top of how easy it, it is, everything went the way you would hope it would. Which made it really easy. Okay, so Snake Eyes doesn't have double tap right now, apparently. That's something to be concerned about a little bit. means we only have these three people left. Okay, we can fire a rocket with Crater right here. Wait, that guy's dead, isn't he? Should just be this one guy. Ooh, that's the first time it hasn't gone perfectly for us. Take him out, John. <laughs> Over the ledge. Whee! It is down. Alright, then let's get shield in there, and we're done. Unless we have to get everybody in there. We've got analysts waiting to there check it is. out the new data. And I'm sure our operative could use a rest. Good work. Easy. Come on, give us a good hint, or I'm gonna start taking out countries. Effort, not a single casualty. Of course, not a single injury or anything. Um, new intel's in the database. Credit reward 100. Panic produced by one in Argentina. Decryption of recovered data has revealed new information about the local location of the Exalt base. The Exalt base is not in Japan. Okay, well, it is what it is. I'm just going to start taking out headquarters. Intel decryption completed. Recalculating possible Exalt facility locations. Let's get rid of all these. Wish we could break them for weapon fragments, but it is what it is. 
Okay. So there's four countries that we can risk taking out here. Russia, France, Germany, and India. Which do we want Mana most risk inciting and making angry? Satellite uplink facilities at India gives 60. Additional uplink India gives the least amount of money. And the, and the Asia bonus is whatever, I think. So, let's go India. What just happened? Hello? Attempt raid on Exalt HQ. Raiding a country that is not harboring the Exalt base will cause the country to leave the XCOM project. Sure you want to do this? Yep. Analyzing intelligence data. Exalt base location. Identity. That's it, Commander. Oh! Based on the compiled what? intelligence reports, we've confirmed the location of Exalt's primary base. We can launch an assault against the facility on your order. Wow. Let's go. The one in four chance. That is awesome. Yes. Wow. I was just getting ready to like piss off a couple countries and have them leave, but look at that. It went perfectly. India's harboring the Exalt base. Trouble. The aliens are probably more than a little upset that we didn't fall in line like they'd hoped. We've successfully determined that India is harboring the Exalt base. We can now send a squad to assault the base and eliminate the Exalt threat at its source. Oh my god, that's awesome. That'll be what we do next time. <laughs> I can't believe we got the one in four. That's so lucky. Especially for me. <laughs> we'll take it. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving a like. And if you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. Either way, thank you so much for joining me on this journey through XCOM. And we'll see you for the Exalt HQ Raid next time.